This video is brought to you by Squarespace. Konnichiwa! Today we are in Kawagoe, a historic city that gives you a glimpse of what Japan was like back in the day. This is a popular tourist destination for a day trip from Tokyo and we'll show you exactly why. Way you look today. Thank you. You look very Japanese. You blend yeah. right in. I bought this in uh, Shibuya. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just saw that they like to accessorize. They like to wear like long dresses, t-shirts, and copying their style. This might be my new thing. Every country I go to, I'm gonna find outfit. <laughs> So I'm not sure if you're up for this or not, but I've been seeing a lot of Japanese girls and guys yeah, and dressed up Look. yeah, in the kimonos. So cute. Of course I'm up for it. <laughs> it's a hot day. That's why I was going to ask you first because I do see a kimono shop just over there. This says no waiting time. I think usually you got to book in advance, mm -hmm. so we're lucky. A lot of the things here in Japan you have to reserve. Yeah. yeah, except for some restaurants that you got to just go early and walk in um, because the seating is so limited, they don't even take reservations. I'm down for kimono. Okay, let's do let's it. Let's go check it out, see how much it is. This is exciting. Hi! Konnichiwa! Hi! Konnichiwa. Hi. 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 Okay. <laughs> oh, we can do that? Oh, okay. What do you say? We can ride the rickshaw today for free. It's around a 15 minute ride down the street. Includes yeah. with the package. I think so. understanding is that these ones are thicker so they're hotter. So I'm going to choose this type of kimono and it's a two-piece set versus these ones are just a one-piece yukata. And they are 5,500 5, each? 5,500 because today is a weekend. If you come on a weekday it's 5,000. So I need to choose. A few moments later. Let me first say that you look incredible. Thank you. <laughs> wow. This was such an experience already just to put this on. I think I have 20 layers of fabric on. Yeah, the amount of details. And crazy. about 30 hairpins in my hair. It's really cool. It took probably like 30, 45 minutes. But now we're ready and the shop owner, she's walking us to where the rickshaw is because we have a free 15 minute ride towards the temple, the shrine. You look pretty amazing yourself. Thank I you. I gotta say though, I thought it would be hot, but my outfit is uh, pretty flowy. Yeah, I thought I'm pretty much wearing nothing, nothing <laughs> under there. And the total, total cost for the two of us okay. is 115. No, no, 11,500 yen. That's not bad for a whole day. Mine's more expensive. Mine's 7,500 because I have all the accessories. Yours mm -hmm. is 5,000 yen. I see the rickshaws. And the, the rickshaw drivers are wearing really short, short, short. You like that? Hi, konnichiwa. Konnichiwa. <laughs> We don't understand. Ah, okay, so two cars just uh, oh. go. Left? Yeah. Okay. Try. Okay. Try. Come back. So uh, after maybe 20 minutes. 20 minutes. Okay. Yeah, 25 minutes. Yeah. Okay, sounds good. We'll come back here. <laughs> Bye. See you later. See you. That's so nice. Well, that's good. We have enough time to show the full show outfit. Show you our outfit. So this is the kimono that I chose, a beautiful light blue color with a lot of accessories and you get to choose every single piece to match it and I think it's pretty cute. Yeah, I think you did a good job. 
And when they were putting it on, they kept telling me, Kawaii ne! What does it mean? Very cute. <laughs> and you're like walking in those uh, sandals? It's so funny because the socks are separate. Mm. I mean, Interesting, like, yeah. yeah. The socks already give you the separation. It's not like I'm wearing normal socks and I have to wear these sandals. I cannot walk really fast because I can only move so much wearing this. So I have to take small steps. Let's see your outfit. Mine is a lot simpler. <laughs> Just a robe and a belt. I feel nice. like you are allowed to eat more because this helps support your belly, doesn't it? Yeah, because when she was tidying it, I thought she would tie higher up, but she's actually roll my boxers down. If you lift this up, you will see half of my body. <laughs> and I pretty much wear nothing inside, just my boxers. Nice. I went to the washroom, it was pretty easy. I just loop, loop. <laughs> yeah. You would look even better in a rickshaw outfit. Yeah, I like I like your outfit more. You like this one. He wants to wear this. No, yeah. You wear this, Thank I wear that. Okay. You go first, yeah? Okay. <laughs> this is to prevent us from falling off. Well, there's actually a seatbelt in here. Oh. I feel like back in the day, there wouldn't have been a seatbelt. <laughs> okay, now okay. race to the rickshaw, please lean back. Okay, lean okay. back. Three, one, two, three. Oh. Okay, when you are hip, back, back. Okay. Hip, okay. Okay. Okay, very good. <laughs> See you soon. See you soon. Bye. bye. Have a good trip. <laughs> bye. Okay, let's go. Checking out the rickshaw. Yeah, you've been complimenting <laughs> them a lot. How many steps do you do a day? How many uh, steps? Uh, uh, steps? Yeah. Uh -huh. 50,000? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> so every day, uh, 20 kilometers. Wow. wow. Good for you. Yeah. Okay, now hopping, hopping. Hopping. Okay. One, two, three. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> and that's it. We're here. Yeah, it was a short ride, but it was it was fun. It was very pleasant. He's, and he's, he's so awesome. kind. He's so kind, and I love that he's also chatty, which is nice. <laughs> okay. Hold on. Okay, one, two, three. Okay. 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 Thank you so much. Thank you so much. In shrines of your picture. Picture. Okay. Okay. In, so I take your picture. Oh, in, oh okay. Yes, in, in, in the shrine. In the yes. shrine. <laughs> oh. I'm a professional photographer. No way. Yes. No. yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's a added bonus, huh? Yeah. Bye bye. Yes, <laughs> wow. <laughs> that was so much fun. <laughs> I didn't expect that at all. Like the ride was bonus, and then he's a great photographer. We have some really nice photos. Yeah. Real quick, we just wanted to say a big thank you to our longtime partner Squarespace for sponsoring this video. Squarespace is an all-in-one platform where you can easily build a website for your blog or business and you can save a lot of time by starting with one of their award-winning templates. Knowing that Squarespace has built-in responsive design means your website is going to look good on any device. You can even manage your website using the Squarespace app where you can check the traffic analytics to your website and make quick changes on the go. Just head over to squarespace.com for a free trial and when you're ready to launch, go to squarespace.com slash flora and note to save 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain. Now let's get back to the video. So the shrine we are now at is called the Kawagoe 
Kumano Shrine, which is a popular place for people to come to to wish for wealth, to wish for luck, and also for couples looking to、uh, have good relationships. Everything is in Japanese. Yeah, but you can scan the QR code on these signs. Like, for example, this one here it says, This is the Akiha Shrine, commonly known as Akiha Sama, and the god of Kabo here protects against theft. So, for many people who may use fire, such as firefighters and cooks and stuff, we can also enjoy the benefits of protection. But yeah, there's so many of these signages. All over, so you don't need a guide. It's like a self guided tour、mm -hmm. of the shrine, and whatever that you're wishing to leave an offering and blessing for, you can do yourself. I assume here each writing means different things、luck. you wish for. Yeah. yeah, that one actually says that it's for、uh, any anything you want in your heart. You can、true. read it? Yeah, because this is kanji, so it's based on like Chinese characters. That one is. Money, this one is health, this one is work and school and education, and the last one is luck. I'm gonna go for health first. Oh, what am I doing? <laughs> oh, this is hard. This is really hard. I'm gonna do it again. <laughs> Are you allowed to? <laughs> yeah. I know why, because I'm holding my purse. Maybe get the、uh, three extra just in case. Yeah. <laughs> What do you get? I got、um, work, education, and love. I'm gonna get the rest for you. Okay. Well, I got the other three for you, and you got the other two. Perfect. Perfect. Teamwork. What did you find? Taco sundae. I think it's. Four hundred. I think it's octopus cracker. It looks so good. Just try it. I'm hungry too. Okay. Wow. Alright. Arigatou gozaimasu. Wow. Hmm. It sounds so crispy. So crispy. So tasty. It's like um. Does it taste like rice cracker or not? Crackers with、uh, squid. Is it more like a crepe crepe batter? No. Oh. More like crackers. Wow. Wow. You can take the whole um <laughs> tentacle here. Hmm. There's like more flavor in this area. You know what? Everything we ate so far here in Japan has been so delicious.、Mm. There wasn't a single thing that I ate and was like not, not amazing. Good,、yeah. <laughs> It's been so good, and I feel like people always say Japan is so expensive, and it is true if you go to like a lot of the if you compare it and and if you compare it to Southeast Asia.、Mm. But. I think what you're getting, like the quality of the food, it's very reasonably priced, and you can easily get, you know, delicious food for like ten dollars or less.、Mm -hmm. So Kawagoe is also known as Little Edo because Edo is a period in Japanese history in the 1600s, I believe, and it's a part of the history that's so important because a lot of Japanese cuisine and culture and theater and arts all kind of started from that period. And when we're here in Kawagoe, you're going to notice that a lot of these older houses are basically what it would look like back in the time. So there are a couple highlights in Kawagoe, and one of them is this street over here. I believe it is. Like a merchant street, so along here you can see a lot of small vendors selling some traditional snacks and sweets. But、it's、almost、so、every stores have lineup. Yeah, it's <laughs> so lively. There are so many things I want to try. I see right here. There's kawagoe pudding. I saw soft serve ice cream. I saw those traditional red bean Japanese sweets. And across the street is、What's、cheesecake.、That? Japanese, Japanese cheesecake. cheesecake. 
Oh my goodness. <laughs> It's nice to sit down. <laughs> the shoes are not the most comfiest. Oh wow. Yield is not cheap in Japan. Mm -hmm. Look at this premium yield. 8800 and the cheapest one is 4400 So what did we get? I got um, one deluxe eel set and also a cold tofu dish which is on their special menu. It'll be nice to eat something a little cold. <laughs> This is one tiny tofu. How much is it again? 600 yen. 600 yen. That's, I didn't know that's if, five bucks for I this didn't tofu. know it's going to be that small. Maybe it's very, very delicious. <laughs> wow, the texture is different. It's so thick. It's really delicious. It's not normal tofu. It's, I don't know how to explain it. It's more gooier, almost between like a rice cake and a tofu. I've never had anything like that. You have to try this. You're gonna be so surprised. You're gonna be like, oh, it's worth it. <laughs> Wait, you have to say, do you like it? Love it. <laughs> Is it worth it? Yes, it's worth it. <laughs> I'm gonna break this in four pieces. Yeah, I was like, don't, don't. Because eat all we of have it. to like slowly enjoy it. This is so delicious. This is like a dessert. Like, how do they the make texture the texture? Like it's so creamy, and it's the sauce like is a the cake. peanut miso sauce. It's a sesame sauce. Sesame sauce, mm. and with the hint of wasabi in there. Oh yeah, can, can you even imagine what the unagi is going to be like? Wow, that's incredible. Wow. Arigato gozaimasu. You ready? Oh, oh my goodness. Look at the color on that. Oh, it's so hot. It smells so good. I'm so excited. We both love unagi don. We love it. So I've never tried it in Japan before. This is so exciting. It's so soft. Let me get a perfect bite here. Look at that. That is incredible. I literally got goosebumps. This is this is the best unagi don I've ever had it's so soft it's not overly sweet because you know some places they the sauce is so sweet it's just perfect this is amazing i love japan <laughs> Just a pickled house. There's different pickled items and this huge pickled cucumber. I think this actually might be a good little treat to uh, clear the the uh, fattiness from the eel. We can get one and just eat over there. Okay. Can we get one? Wow, okay. Yes. Okay. Thank you. We'll take this one. Oh, no. no, that's not. That, that's that's the fake one. Fake one. Wow, yeah, you good. Good. Wow. Finish it. I've never seen such shiny cucumber before. <laughs> Perfect shape. Yeah. I didn't know cucumber can taste this good. <laughs> it's so crunchy, sweet and sour and salty. But all the taste balanced perfectly. It's not too sour. 
Well, that's why that lady just before us bought like half a dozen mm -hmm. cucumbers. It's quite refreshing. <laughs> oh. So we're coming to another popular stop here in Kawagoe and it is the Bell Tower. So this bell rings four times a day and it's a very iconic symbol of the city. I read something before that there was a huge fire in this area and a lot of the wooden houses were burnt down, including the bell tower. But the residents here and the shop owners decided to rebuild the bell tower first before rebuilding their own shops because it's such a significant part of the city. Wow. Isn't that neat? Yes. So of course we have to come and visit the bell tower. Can we go up there and ring it? I don't think so. <laughs> it does ring four times a day. I wonder if we'll be lucky enough to hear it. We had such an amazing day here exploring Kawagoe. You must add this place to your list next time when you go to Tokyo because it's only about a one hour to an hour and a half ride on the train to get to here. There is so much to see here and of course so much to eat. So as always, thank you so much for watching. Have a wonderful day and we will see you in the next one. Bye! Bye bye! I know there's a way Cause if I'm being true I must say that